Hello and welcome back to the channel everybody. It's good to be here. Happy holidays to you, your family and loved ones. I truly hope you found some time to relax and enjoy yourself during the holiday time. It's been wonderful. I bring to you a very special episode of Terra Cards today. And you might be asking me, well, what makes it so special? Is it the holidays? I mean, the holidays are special indeed. But the holidays isn't what makes this particular episode special. So let me explain that a little bit more. First and foremost, let's dive into version 1.2.7.1, the mostly bug-free realm of tarot cards. Now, to get into what I was saying before about this episode being special, what makes it special, folks, is as of the time of recording, we have reached 100 subscribers on the channel. And I'm super pumped, I'm super happy, I'm super jacked about that. And I have you fine people to thank, this fine community of awesome people. Thank you so much. You have uh, really helped me just create higher quality content with your comments, you know, your, your viewership, your subscriptions, things like that. And you've really helped, you know, a, a very small channel like mine out. And I just can't thank you enough. I, I can't express enough gratitude to everyone in this community. Thank you so, so much. I really appreciate it. Happy holidays. And because of that, I want to do something special for you. So what do I want to do that's special for you? Well, I seem to have stumbled in to something, a combination that isn't listed in the encyclopedia that I am going to show you today. And what will I be showing you? Well, let me show you. I'm going to show you how to make Santa's reindeer. I stumbled into this today. Uh, I presented a few uh, screenshots on Discord, right? Nobody's gotten back to me yet, so let's see if I can kind of retrace my steps and figure out exactly how I did it. But it involves uh, regular cows and apples. So we did grab the apple tree. That's why we grabbed the apple tree. We're going to try to replicate this. I envision this as just a quicker video today. What I mainly wanted to do is just jump on and say thank you so much to this awesome community. 100 subscribers is amazing. And like I said, you've really helped inspire just a very small time content creator like myself to do more consistent and bigger awesome things. So once again, thank you so much. If you wanna get on the bandwagon and become a subscriber, well, you know where the subscribe button is. Please click right on in. We'd be happy to have you. And again, thank you everybody so much for your viewership. Happy holidays. All right, now, as far as getting on to creating the famed Santa's reindeer, we're gonna need a little bit of a base here to do so. So let's grab some fences. I mean, right now we're just not really sitting very pretty. I got a few sunflowers out there, right? But as far as having what we need, we just don't have that yet. We need some water. Could go water well, I suppose. I like blue wheat better though. So let's go blue wheat. And then pair that with a watery tree that we hopefully get in the next few turns. You guys know my opening. Everybody knows my opening who's seen my videos by now. Always go sunflower, always go blue wheat. In fact, if you want to come up with a creative challenge video for me, it should be one that does not involve me to open that way, right? So, not great that we haven't seen the water tree yet, but that's okay. We're still doing okay on water in general. Elite cows, sure thing. There's our watery tree in all its glory. You love to see it, folks. Let's throw down some beans here to boost the production of our sunflowers a little bit further. Let's get that watery tree on the board and then let's start building a build that is going to render us, or at least attempt to render us, 
the reindeer. So I'm going to get some apple trees out on the board there. And we're going to throw in some cows. Just regular basic cows. You see their little portraits there with the, with the hat on. Real nice touch. Gotta love that. Waterwell carrot mill. Rabbit medium fence. Electric carrot. We can grab some more sunflowers while we kind of wait out for what we need. Get our apple tree on the board as well. Melter, more sunflowers. How about more apple trees? Yeah, we'll take, well, let's actually take the juicer. The juicer is one of the items we need. At least I think. But I'm hoping you walk away from this video today, for those of you viewing, with two things. Number one, I hope you understand my high level of appreciation for this awesome community. And number two, I hope you walk away knowing how to make a reindeer. Those are the two objectives today, and if we achieve those two things, then it's all gravy from there for sure. So why don't we take a close look at the reindeer. So the reindeer is, it's very strong, I believe, if you can get elves on the board, right? So it's going to go really well with the Jingle Clux build. Uh, check out my video on that. It was a few videos ago. Jingle, Jingle Clucks goes nuclear. Made me like a quintillion dollars. I think it was a bug, but I mean, still super insanely powerful, right? But the Jingle Clucks gives you the elf egg, which in a bird nest gives you the elf, right? So if you have a bunch of elves, which you will, then you can really make use of the reindeer and apple trees, right? And you could probably take your game to super, super, super late game with that build, I believe. I'm not going to do that here. I'm simply going to show you how to make the reindeer. Because who doesn't like the reindeer? It's like the Cadillac of hooved animals for sure. So why don't we get some grapes in here too? Sure thing. Have to get a fuel solution too before our buildings work properly as well. So we'll work on that too. Crusher's not going to do us much good. Pasteurizer either. Looking for a fermenter and a fuel solution. Let's get Dionysian rights. You betcha. Let's get some more apple trees down. Find a little spot for this here. Water well. So we can throw it right here to get a few more apples. Uh, crows, it's not going to do us much good. Fuel corn, that will be our fuel solution, you bet. So we'll grab that and continue to play our apple trees. Fuel corn, this is a fine island for it right here, if I don't say so myself. Got a nice full island of apple trees. Some field corn. Now our juicer will be operational. You love to see that. And we don't really have the cash to re-roll here. So I think you're going to find, like, going early reindeer, depending on your build, of course, might not be the most efficient thing to do. But, I mean, it's the reindeer. It's, it's the card that showed up in the update that I personally was captivated by, right? And I believe I've stumbled into the solution to making it. We just got to get there. So let's get there together. Whoops, that wasn't what I wanted to do, but that's okay. More blue wheat, goodness. The game is just hooking up the blue wheat right now. Which, I'm not complaining. Definitely not complaining. Love me some blue weed. It's just downright overpowered with the, with the sunflower and the watery tree. 
fuel wheat, sugar cane, fuel corn. I guess we do have some fuel corn on the board already, so let's just go ahead and grab that. And continue on in this fashion. So how was everybody's holiday? Did you get the opportunity to see some friends and family that maybe you don't get the chance to see so often? What was your highlight? And did you get a gift that you really liked? Did you get, you know, some family from out of town coming in to see you? Maybe you made some new friends. Maybe you made some new connections. What was the highlight of your holiday? Let me know in the comments. For me personally, uh, so I have a pretty big family. And seeing everybody, kind of my whole extended family, was really nice. It happened over the span of a few weekends, but... You know, I got the chance to see some grandparents, aunts, uncles, nieces, nephews, cousins, all of that. Also was able to spend uh, the night with uh, my immediate family last night to celebrate. And it was just a good overall time. Uh, my dad usually makes spaghetti. Funny, funnily enough, he makes spaghetti for uh, Christmas time. So he, uh, he whipped up a batch of that. Well, I guess he doesn't whip it up. It takes a long time for him to make because he's really precise with it. But he made a real good batch of spaghetti. And, you know, we had some spaghetti, did some gifts, hung out, enjoyed our time together as uh, family members for sure. So that was the highlight of my Christmas. How about yours? Or, or holiday season? However you celebrate. Let me know in the comments. Alright, we did get our fermenter here, so let's throw that down. We're going to get some wine production. And you're going to notice now we have some crazy cows here. So the crazy cow, it gives you yogurt, believe it or not. But it costs an insane amount of water. But it gives you yogurt, which is, you know, uh, two steps up from just your basic milk as far as the production chain goes. So that's kind of cool. I don't condone giving uh, your animals wine, though. So here's our ager. All right. So this is going to do... Uh, this is going to give us apple cider. And I believe, folks, that this is the key to making Santa's reindeer. Right here, the ager, the apple cider. So let's take a quick peek at apple cider so you understand. Got the apple, goes into the juicer, which goes in the fermenter to make fermented apple juice, and then into the ager to make apple cider, okay? So we're gonna get some apple cider production right here on this island that shares the island with our cows, and let's see what happens. Boom, right there. The apple cider, when fed to just the regular cows, they don't necessarily have to be crazy cows, but it apparently works with crazy cows as well. The apple cider is what creates Santa's reindeer for you. So that's pretty cool, isn't it? And personally, I, I love this sprite. I think it's one of the best sprites in the game. It's a nice mighty reindeer. Reminds me of like a Stantler or something for you Pokemon fans. Tremendous. So like I said, that's going to go the best with the Jingle Clux elf build for sure, which is already very strong in its own right. If you saw my last video, but that is how you make the reindeer from what I understand Apple cider on the same island as a cow or maybe adjacent as well Supposed to be good supposed to be good. check that out. Let's see. Let's see if this creates a reindeer as well Yeah, it does okay, so it's just adjacent so the cow will drink the apple cider and turn into Santa's reindeer so that is Santa's reindeer for you and Santa's reindeer itself it doesn't produce anything, even though it has a production value. I'm not sure what it's producing. Let's see if we can figure that out. Uh, what is it producing? Like, we're not getting milk. Wouldn't be producing apple cider. 
Hard to say what it's producing, but it does have a production. Oh, never mind. It did last turn. Again, folks, this is Terra Cards. Just the ever, uh, the ever wonderful game of Terra Cards that always keeps you scratching your head a little bit and wondering what's up. But that is how you make Santa's reindeer. And you saw it here first, or maybe it didn't, but that's okay. Either way, this is a celebratory video to again just say thank you so much to everybody in this community. You folks have been awesome. I'm not going to long play this, just wanted to show you how to make the reindeer. But I did, again, want to say thank you so much. So happy holidays to everybody. If you're new here, please like and subscribe. You know, let's keep this train rolling. And uh, again, uh, comment, comment down below, let me know how your holidays went. Uh, also comment below if you'd like to see me play some other games. If you'd like to see me do some challenge runs in tarot cards. I'm very flexible. I enjoy playing tarot cards. I know the community loves tarot cards as well. So it's definitely uh, a staple I'm going to continue to bring to the channel. But if you want to see me broaden out a little bit, let me know your thoughts. Let me know your opinions. I want to build a community of people here. And so far this community has been fantastic. It's been amazing. So thank you so much. I'm going to end the video here. Happy holidays. And we're going to catch you in the next video. Just stay tuned. Got plenty more content on the way. Thank you so much. Bye.